Da Nang can be seen as a relatively new city when compared with the 4,000 year history of the Vietnamese people. At the beginning of the 14th century, Da Nang was part of the O and Rai districts, which were used as wedding presents by the Chem King to marry Princess Huyen Tran of Dai Vi, as Vietnam was called then. At that time, Da Nang was a wild area with sandy beaches with many lakes and marshes lying around the Han River. It was not until the mid-15th century that the Le Dynasty extended the territory southward and established Quang Nam province, including the present-day Da Nang. In the 17th century, Da Nang appeared on the map of Vietnam. This coincided with a mass migration of people from the north in search of a new area in which to settle. Many Chinese, Japanese, French, Dutch, Portuguese, and Spanish merchants came to do their business through the Dai Cham port and then the Da Nang port. At the beginning of the 17th century, the French and Portuguese set foot in this area to start their business at the Han River port. In 1858, a flotilla of French and Spanish joint forces entered the Han River port to attack Da Nang, beginning their scheme to conquer Vietnam. In 1888, Da Nang became a concession of France, and it was called Tourance. The French considered Tourance as one of the five major cities in Indochina. In 1945, the August Revolution succeeded in ousting the French, and the name of the city was changed to Tai Pien City. The French considered Tourance as one of the five major cities of Indochina. In 1945, the August Revolution succeeded in ousting the French, the name of the city was changed to Tai Pien City, under the management of the central government of the Democratic Republic of Vietnam, led by President Ho Chi Minh. In 1965, the American Army chose Da Nang as the first landing place in South Vietnam, turning Da Nang into the biggest joint Navy infantry air base in South Vietnam. The fierce struggle of the Da Nang people for independence continued through 30 years from 1945 to 1975. Having achieved glorious military feats, Da Nang was honored by the state with the title Heroic City. After the complete liberation of South Vietnam in 1975, the central government merged Da Nang into Quang Nam province to become an administrative unit under the central management. In December 1996, Da Nang was separated from Quang Nam Da Nang province. The government of Da Nang City was inaugurated officially on January 1st, 1997.